Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So let me show you guys where I've just come out from. So that's the beautiful Natural History Museum in London. So I've literally just come out from the museum now and I had a heated conversation with some guys talking about cryptocurrencies. So we just got talking and they were talking about the crash and I was saying, well, it's only, you know, temporary, it's not permanent. I said, it's only temporary. This is not going to last long. And they were talking about the stock market crash and, and I thought, hmm, interesting. So I told them what I was thinking. So I thought maybe I should tell you guys what I'm thinking as well. So I wasn't going to do this video talking about a market crash, but then yesterday I did see a guy on YouTube that's fact out exactly what I was thinking so I thought I'll put the video in my channel so I messaged him and I said yes it was okay so stay tuned for Brandon all right so you see the market the market is at 340 billion dollars usually you're used to seeing it above 650 billion and I just wanted to give you guys um, the reason why the market has been crashing so much. So for cryptocurrency, I mean, in my own opinion, I'm not going to say that this is the exact reason, for, but from my observation is basically there's a lot of new crypto investors coming into the area. And what happens is a lot of them are just so used to crypto just increasing all the time. A lot of them don't do a lot of their market analysis and they don't really see that cryptocurrency is very volatile. It's going to increase and it's going to decrease as well. So a lot of times what happens is people start to see that the prices go down, they panic and the price starts to go down. Now, when other people go to coin market cap and they see that the price is going down as well, they get scared as well. And this is what happens. Panic selling starts to happen. And I think this is what's been happening. This is why we've been seeing such a decrease in the prices. Today is not as bad. It's pretty much like sea of green, kind of. But like I said, man, go ahead and get these coins. They're going to go back up. Like, I, I cannot stress this enough. Go and get the coins that you have not been able to get for good prices. Go ahead and get it. Prices like Ripple that hasn't been under a dollar for a while it's at around 70 cents right now you could go ahead maybe in a week or two that's gonna hit two dollars again you're gonna be able to triple your money again ethereum ethereum was over a thousand the other day it's at 700 like you can get a lot of cheap coins bitcoin is at 7k go ahead get some cheap bitcoin stop panic selling hodl the main goal is if you see these coins you love the project behind them go ahead and support the project the projects aren't going to be something overnight it's gonna have to take a while these companies like snapchat and stuff they didn't happen overnight these were like ongoing projects it took three four five years six years for them to reach major success same thing for facebook they just kept integrating integrating until they grew to a substantial point where you know their stock price started to ultimately increase. Increase. It wasn't always at over a hundred dollars. They had to get to that point. So far for these projects, they aren't at their maximum point. They're not even t towards their maximum potential. So you have to give it time to grow. I know that it, you see the prices going down, but this is not the max price you're gonna see. If you see some of these coins hitting seven hundred dollars, and you see some of these other coins are below a dollar. You have to give them time to grow. Stop panic selling. Stop. Hodl. In a year or two, we will all be very wealthy. Hodl. Go and buy. See you in my next video. Peace. So, yes, that's it, guys. Let me know what you guys are thinking. Let me know if you're holding your cryptocurrency. Let me know if you sold some cryptocurrency. I mean, it's nice to, you know... We're a community. We should speak sometimes. So yes, I'll see you guys on my next channel. If you like this video and you like the style of this video, 
please thumbs up so I can do more videos like this because there's so many beautiful places in London that I can show you guys because I know most of you guys watching me are not from London. I know that because YouTube tells me. <laughs> so I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.